What's going on there, everyone? We're going to take a quick walk here. You see this solitude right here? I'm going to show you how not to chalk your wheels on your RV. How not? It's got to be, this is a nice rig. It's got to be $100,000 plus dollar rig. And they might just lose it because they don't know how to chalk the tires. Don't let this be you. All right, here we are. Look. Check out those tires. Look. Chalks. This is acceptable here. See? One in the front, one in the back. You've got them on both sides, one in the front, one in the back. That's acceptable. This guy here. No chalks at all. Zero chalks on his camper. Can you believe it? I mean, I don't understand. This is how I like to do it. There's a bunch of ways to do it. One on this tire, one on this tire. That way you're covering both tires and you're covering both directions, forward and back. Be best if you have one on the other side as well. You can go on the opposite sides, one forward, one back. That way you got everything covered. But never, ever, ever, don't do that. You never know which way this might roll. You get a wind, you get a push, you never know. Both sides, you wanna stop it from moving, both sides. Okay, the other reason that that guy is a complete moron, in addition to having him on the exact same side, so he can only stop his camper from moving one way, but he has his chalks, nothing stopping them from moving the other way at all. But those chalks are also very, very small. You got a lot of money in your rig. Don't be going out there with those small little chalks. Get yourself a good, solid pair of chalks. Put the link to some good ones below. Don't be an idiot. Don't lose your rig because you're an idiot. Chalk your wheels, front and back.